Hello there, today we're going to dive into the art of duplicating your projects in Final Cut Pro. To create a duplicate of your project, follow these simple steps. First, locate the project you wish to duplicate and give it a click. Now venture up to the menu bar and select Edit, then choose Duplicate Project. Alternatively, you can use the handy shortcut Command-D. Voila, a duplicate of your project magically appears in the browser. Feeling creative with names? Go ahead and left-click the name to give it a personalized title. Here's the cool part. These duplicates are entirely separate projects. Anything you tinker with in one won't affect the other. In other words, your original project remains as pristine as ever. Duplicates are fantastic for creating a safety net for your original project. You can experiment with new clips or styles in the duplicate version without any repercussions on the original. Now let's talk about compound clips. These can be a tad tricky, but we've got your back. But before we dive into that, how about brightening up our day with a thumbs up? It's a small gesture that tells me I'm on the right track and helps others find this video. Thanks. Here's the deal with compound clips. When you make a duplicate of a project that includes a compound clip, that compound clip exists in both projects. So if you make edits in one project, it'll affect the compound clip in the other. Think of a compound clip as a mini project within your timeline. If you expand a compound clip by double clicking it, it opens up just like a project. Neat, right? Let's demonstrate this. We'll create a duplicate of this project and give it a snazzy name like Dope. We can also duplicate the project as a snapshot, giving it a cool name like Shot. Now back to our original project. Let's see what happens when we edit the compound clip. We'll double click to open it up, remove the video clip of this pizza, and poof, it's gone, replaced with an empty black clip. Now, here's the kicker. If we hop over to the duplicate project, you'll notice that the changes we made also affected the compound clip here. But guess what? In our snapshot project, the compound clip remains untouched, and the cheese is still gloriously intact. So, when you're working with projects containing compound clips, duplicating your project as a snapshot can be a smart move to prevent any accidental changes. In conclusion, creating duplicates of your project allows you to experiment and practice without messing up your original masterpiece. Now it's time to explore an easy way to share your Final Cut Pro projects with the world. Click here to check it out.